this here our shack barbecue and other things so it's been a little while since I've done a video and uh, like it says I'm back feeling good ready to do some cooks um, but they're gonna be on the healthier side so I'm gonna say they're heart healthy a little bit uh, and we're gonna start out I did some chicken breast skin on bone-in chicken breast and these are pretty big breasts uh, but what we did is my sister uh, found this rub, spice rub from Weber, that has no salt in it. So we're going to give that a try and see how it turns out. We're going to do it on a Weber kettle, and we're going to do some corn on the cob with some unsalted butter and um, put some Mrs. Dash seasoning on it. Um, and uh, we'll get into this cook. So hope you enjoy it. Regulators. You regulate any stealing of his property. We're damn good, too. But you can't be any geek off the street. You gotta be handy with the steal if you know what I mean. Earn your keep. Regulators! Mount up! Okay, so we have our uh, chicken breast here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a little bit of extra virgin oil on them. And then we're gonna hit them with this Weber chicken salt free chicken rub so we'll give this okay, a so try we're just going to take some old extra virgin olive oil here put it on each one like so and we'll come in and wipe it all down there give her a nice coating it over just add a little bit now these have bones in them so we'll see how well they do here all right so let me wash my hands okay now we're gonna come in with our rub I'm gonna sprinkle it on there mm, that looks really good once again, this is salt-free chicken rub. Okay, so I flipped them over and I seasoned the bone side. Now we're going to flip them back over and we're going to just add some more seasoning to the top uh, that came off. And then we'll go out and get the grill set up, get a chimney going for our charcoals, and then we'll get these uh, cooking. Okay, so we're using the Weber kettle. We're using an indirect system. We have the slow and sear up to temp. We're running uh, 375 to 400. And we're going to cook the breast skin side up first on the indirect side. I'm getting the thicker part of the breast closer to the actual heat. And we're going to let this go for eh, 20 minutes and then we'll come out and check it. Okay, so now we're going to just do a quick little sear on these. So, get it over there. Away for a minute. This is just going to kind of firm up the skin and give a nice sear mark on them. Okay, so we got a nice little sear on all these. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cook them now with the bone up, skin down. Uh, let's say we're gonna go another 20 minutes like this, and then we're gonna come back out and flip them back over. In the 
the meantime, we're gonna get the corn on here. So what I did is I pulled the husk back and I oiled the corn um, and then I soaked them in water for about an hour. Go for another 15. All right, let's see what we're running at now. We're up over 165. So it's time to pull these off and dive into them. So here we have our chicken breast that we use the Weber salt free chicken seasoning on. Let's cut into it and see what it looks like. Nice and juicy. Mmm, looks really good. Just cut a little bite here. That is really good. For being salt free, man, that's a good rub. Oh yeah. Chicken is perfectly cooked. Oh, let's go in for another bite. Mm. Oh. You might have to try to find you some of this. Um, we got it at a grocery store called Safeway, um, just in their spices area. I think Walmart might carry it. Uh, I have some more other uh, no salt uh, rubs that I'm going to be using on some different items, like a uh, you know a seasoned steak. Mm. Can't wait to try that one. Anyway, hope you enjoy this and grill on.